So uh, from the work I do, uh, I've been in a spiritual medium for over 30 years now, and um, I was one of the first ones out there um, uh, before Sylvia Brown, I might say, and, and John, John Edwards, a friend of mine. And I, I would say I was out there really as a pioneer, and that, that was my work. And the work that I did, really, I was just doing it privately, but I knew the spirit world had a very different uh, agenda for me. Um, and so I remember the first, I was just doing readings for people, and the word got out, and someone contacted me from the Joan Rivers show. The Joan Rivers show in New York, the daytime talk show. And that was the very first TV show that I did, it was then. And she was phenomenal. I loved her, fabulous, loved her energy, sassy, funny, witty, not negative, not what she portrayed. That was kind of an act. She was really a very wise, witty, fun lady. And we used to joke all the time. And she used to say to me, you know, I'm going to haunt your ass when I die. <laughs> she said that to me, those words. And um, she said, when I get to heaven, I'm going to kill Edgar. She said that too. Because <laughs> she never got over his suicide. And then she said, you know, God won't recognize me with all my face work. <laughs> Funny lady. So after she died, I sent out a thought to her. I sent out a thought and I said, just Joni, if, you know, whenever you get a mess time, to just send me a message. Let me know that you're okay. Just bring the focus of my mind to whatever. And uh, that was it. And left it out to the universe. Eastern Pennsylvania, last Saturday night. I'm in the, in the backstage there, just eating a sandwich or something right before finishing the second part of the demonstration. And uh, there was a wall there with all the different celebrities, the thousands of people that had played this theater. And for some reason, I was told, just felt I should look up. And I did. And my eyes went right to, I'm happy here, Joan Rivers. <laughs> Trippy, eh? I, I think these, I was like, oh. Even for me, ah. but I think it happens. I think it happens every day. But do we recognize the signs? When we're in the human head, hard to recognize the signs. You know, they tell us like we're blindfolded. We have to open up our soul's language, the intuition.